Six on the road to recovery. A couple badly injured in a motorcycle crash speaking out tonight, saying they are fortunate to be alive. Last month, the two were on a motorcycle riding through Bridgewater when a car suddenly cut them off. Paul Burton spoke to the injured couple today. I'm happy to be alive. I'm grateful. And I'm not going to be the same individual I was before this incident. David Mitchell and Romney Karakostas know they are very fortunate to be alive. The two were on his Harley Davidson when they got cut off by this red sedan that pulled out of a plaza on Bedford Street in Bridgewater. David had no choice but to lay his bike down. When we hit that curb laying down, it flipped the bike and her and I up and off. I believe the bike continued to travel behind me and probably slammed me into the tree. Police say the driver of the car stops, then takes off. The message I want to say is how could she not stop and leave us there to die? Both sustained severe head and bodily injuries. David was in a coma for three days. He broke his neck and fractured his hip and skull. He saved me. How he handled that bike. And I hope he knows that I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for him. Police were able to catch the driver who will be summoned to court. David has a message for her. Please stop and look. Look carefully. We're looking for you, but we need you to look for us twice. Check twice. Their attorney says it's critical for bikers to get personal injury protection to help cover medical costs, something David does not have, which is why they have set up a GoFundMe page. And it's a big gap. And it's one that some insurance agents do require a signature if you don't take, but 80% of them don't sell it because the risk is too high. Dave has been recovering here at Spalding Rehab Hospital for the past few weeks. Tomorrow he gets to go home. He's thankful he's alive, but he knows he has a long road ahead of him. I thank God for Spalding Rehab and Brigham and Women's for saving my life. I just want to thank everybody for their love and support and for caring about us. Protect yourself and be careful. In Charlestown, I'm Paul Burton, WBZ News.